We're in Backup Exec 15. I'm going to show you how to do a test run on a backup job. Sometimes uh, you want to check to see if a backup is actually going to work properly, so you want to run a test job just to see how that's going to go. Now, you can't do that while you're in the uh, Backup and Restore screen. You have to double-click on the job, and then it'll take you into the tree here, and then we'll, we'll be able to see that option. So what you do is you highlight your job, and then you go up to Test Run, and you just go ahead and click that. It's uh, going to do a test backup, and just to see how, but it's not actually going to do the, the actual backup. So it'll look like it's it's doing the backup, but it'll it'll be much more uh, done much more quickly, in just a fraction of the time an actual backup will take. But it will simulate as if it actually was doing a backup. When it's all done, it'll tell you whether or not it was successful and why, and then you'll be able to adjust your settings in case it fails for some reason. So after just a couple of minutes, it went ahead and, si and switched back from running to scheduled. So in order to see what exactly happened there, just go ahead and click on job history. And when you click on that, we can see that our test run was 100% successful. The byte count is 17 and a half gigabytes. So we know that uh, we're going to be able to run this successfully when we're ready to run it for real.